फ्रेंड्स दिस बुक बाय डॉक्टर बालाजी तांबे पुरुष सुक्तम द अनटोल्ड सीक्रेट्स ऑफ लाइफ आई वुड नॉट से जस्ट लाइफ द अनटोल्ड सीक्रेट्स ऑफ कॉस्मोस एंड लाइफ इज अ प्रोफाउंड वर्क इन डीड इन द सेंस दैट द ऑथर इंटरप्रेट्स पुरुष सुक्तम एज यू नो पुरुष सुक्तम इज फर्स्ट सी सीन इन ऋग्वेद एंड ऑल्सो इट इज सीन इन ऑल द वेदास In fact, Veda, Vyas himself describes Purushottam as the quintessence of all the Vedas. So, it is in that sense, it's extremely important book. Dr. Balaji Tambi has really interpreted it in a very innovative manner. And I, for the first time, I am seeing, and which I always felt, I always felt that this whole universe is coming from a computer science background, is is a, some sort of a great, profound program by itself, a program which is self-aware. the program that is conscious uh, program that can explain the creation you know all science is trying to explain is the what is i think what i asking the vedas are asking also the question um who am i that is the first question i want to understand who am i i want to understand the nature of the universe which i am perceiving which i am cognating i am trying to understand what is the relation of me with the universe this is the question of science this is the question of philosophy this is the question of spirituality purusha suktam i think as the author has put before us tries to explain that in a very very quintessential way this is a short nine 10 shlokas in which um, uh, this is explained what dr balaji tambe the i think the, the genius of dr balaji tambe has done is that he has interpreted it as a conscious program of the universe on one side and the program of our living program of our body as well as who is trying to understand that universe this is this is very remarkable and this can come only from a genius like dr balaji tambe to me as our ancient rishis were to me as as our ancient rishis were they were of course the great philosophers they were also the scientists they were the seers and the sim- scientists simultaneously and that's how we see the coming of i think that the, they were the drashtas of these mantras and uh, the coming of uh, purusha suktam there is another thing which happens in this book is very interesting that uh, when we try to understand or try to read or try to utter the purusha suktam purusha sukta uh, uh, we of course utter the words those who understand sanskrit can uh, but we don't understand if you don't understand the meanings uh, the meanings are mystical meanings are somewhat they are coded there for some reason and for a one deep reason they are actually coded in the in the vedas and so there have been many attempts to to understand to interpret to explain to enunciate what the vedas actually say here we see a a modern a contemporary interpretation of for the contemporary world for contemporary scientific world contemporary spiritual world the uh, meaning of vedas the quintessence of vedas coming coming through in purusha sukta in this book dr balaji tambe takes the original suktas in the sense of word by word interprets its common meanings and then go deep into it and tries to explain it the whole imagery the mystical meaning behind the whole thing in the in today's language this is this is this is this is very important this book has done what uh, i was looking for all along i was looking for that kind of thing that if the vedas are the quintessence of all knowledge they must explain the nature of reality where they must explain the nature of this cosmos the creation itself they must explain my own nature how do i perceive this universe and what is the purpose of my life this book shows us that in fact it shows us that uh, they they say that come this about when when i write a conscious program then after that come this that program can as we see in the computers computer program can can perform functions by means by particular way of using that program i can change my transform my functions this is what the, uh, the author has interpreted and my anatomy my physiology my functioning of brain or this one the function of the cosmos its relationships and how i can actually evolve how can i change my life transform my life uh, uh, and that was the purpose of the vedic mantras in this one um, i think now nowhere i mean, this innovation makes a breakthrough that for the contemporary world in the sense that for young young generation the people who are trying to study science one side one side people who have also understand the, want to understand the philosophy and what is the ancient knowledge system and this book book expresses very beautifully you can see it from the promise very cover itself the the rendition of that cover explains that what 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 is inside which was never done before i think this is the renaissance which will occur why many people say 
many uh, whenever i meet people people say i say that this is the century of india this is the 21st century the century belongs to india and when you look at the century there is one one wonder which i am seeing often wherever i travel across the world that amongst all the ancient civilizations which are, which are, which have come before us the vedic civilization the vedic civilization is the only living civilization over thousands of years we don't know really the, the beginnings and the over 10000 years why is it such a living civilization because it is based on by the very name suggests the vedas based on the knowledge is a knowledge based civilization and the knowledge based people, what is that knowledge that knowledge is not just ordinary knowledge this this knowledge is trying to understand the supreme secrets of the universe of the cosmos my living and how how do i attain i think the super, give a supreme meaning to my life that's what vedas do that's what they do and purushi suktam is the essence of that i think what is the untold secrets is that this secrets have been not narrated in this form and and this is what the genius of uh, dr balaji thambe who is not only an ayurvedic doctor he is an engineer he is an architect he is a farmer on one side he is a healer he is a, a purohit or he is a i think many dimensional person who alone can understand the many dimensions of vedas and this is what i see in purush suktam this is a wonderful book this makes a new uh, new grounds for the new generation to look at our vedas mm-hmm.